Hello, this is Priscilla Batzell. I'm in Spring Hill, Florida. That's a 12 by 24 inch canvas. And my card in the middle is something to focus on, which I will use as a swipe card more than likely. I am going to give myself some paint to help flow other paint, which is my Mead and Black. It's just mixed with Floatrol and GAC 800. I don't know what I'm going to get, but I'm going to take a chance. This is Decor Americana, 24 karat gold. Which I may apply more of. This is Chantilly Lace, this is a prison pour. My go-to is Jasmine. I think I'm going to indulge myself in Quinacridone Nickel Azo Gold from Golden. And a something of an uneven distribution, hopefully. I may stop adding colors at any time. I pulled out a whole bunch thinking I would use them all, but... <laughs> That's not the way this works. This is jasmine. This is a primary element. I do want an organic feeling to this swipe and I may only do the bottom half. It's possible. I have some tempting tulip and another prison pour. Excuse me, another primary element. And I'm being called to orange. I have all kinds of other colors out that I don't have orange out, and I'm being called to orange. This is Orange Crush. I'm tempted to put some of my Indian Spice in there. I have also got out some of the new Magic Slippers from... It's a primary element from the Fairy Tales collection. I don't think I can have too many pinks to tell you the truth, so we'll just add that. I also have Rhapsody Rose, so it looks like there's going to be a lot of red, so I want to kind of turn this around, but I'll just have to drag some of it up. That's my Rhapsody Rose. That's a primary element also. I guess it's just going to get an even dispersal, whether I want to try and do something else or not. I have Amethyst Queen, another primary element from the Fairy Tales collection, and yes, it's open. have a nebulous star, which is a primary element also. I'm going to try a little bit of that. I'm, I'm more inclined to the um, Royal Sapphire, actually. I don't mind it. But what I got out is the Agave Blue, so we'll go with that. And the thing I started with is still sitting here, and that is the Prussian Violet. Which seems like a funny choice on black, but when you add Chantilly Lace, you have a shot at having something better. I've got other colors here, but I don't think I want to put anything else in there, do I? Maybe a little Egyptian Blue? Yeah, I like that. So there, my painting's done. No, kidding. Could be. Kind of like the way that works out. Last but not least, I have Mystique. 
which I believe is another primary element for a little zippy here and there. Yep, that works. That's what goes with the, uh, whatever that color is, the Dark Star. So I'm kind of feeling like I need a little tiny card because I like the idea of leaving behind some of those colors. And I have little tiny cards, even though I had thought I was ready to use. Hi, the one I used the other day is right here. It has a beveled, it has a diagonal end. that. Get out my little scrape dish and use it. If I go from either end and then the middle then I can decide where my marks want to be. I may be traveling up. I think I'm going to be traveling up with this with a spatula and putting tendrils in. That's my intention at this point. Let's see if I want to... use what I've got at my disposal. That may work. It may not. I don't know. I haven't made up my mind yet. Almost ready for some more cell activator. I am ready for some more cell activator. Cell activator is Australian Floetrol and Amsterdam Black. And I, I convince myself that I don't want these even and then I have to put up with the fact that I'm incapable of doing them unevenly. I don't think I'm going to mind that. It's going to be kind of different. I don't know how many of those tendrils I'll do. Might as well keep going though. It really is all about the colors. The cells are nice, but the colors make everything happen. So I'm thinking, I like the idea of there being more than one tendril at a placement. Quite a bit, actually. I like that a lot. off the wrong side of my card. So there's three over there and now I can do one in the middle I guess. Just sort of dipping in pushing. Hurting paint. I like those little tendrils. And the colors in them. Good place for residuals. I could do all kinds of weird stuff with dots and things. Usually these tend up tend up they turn out, they look like people. Not this time. I think there's something else entirely going on here. I want to 
to turn that around. Let's see if it's easier to pull than to push. I don't know yet. I'm happy with the, uh, sorry about that. I got it this time. I stopped it from swinging. and that's the piece of tape that holds a marble that keeps my head from getting in the way. I got one bubble here. I like the abstract configurations. I gotta do something about this end though. Well, let's just do the one next to it first. Well, we can. And I'll come back over here and try. I'm not tender left like that. I'll just use my residuals. Perfect. Now, decisions, decisions. Should there be more? Or should I just call it good? Should I do anything at all? Pull some colors down where I see that it's quite dark at the bottom. Because I'm pretty sure it's going to fill back in. In the area that's heavy. So why don't I just go down all the edges. Right now. But I haven't already. That one it looks like I did it already. But I don't think I did. can't go back the other way. That one needed to happen. That one's looking very dark. I don't actually want to destroy anything cool. I usually put spirals in and I'm not completely allergic to the idea of doing it. Selectively. And then I might call it good. Oh, that was a little white heart. It's a spiral now. The Chantilly lace is going to shimmer. Oh, it's going to be so pretty. So there's a 20% off color art coupon code below Show More. <laughs> right next to a 10% off Pixel Paint Designs code. Pixel Paint Designs will get you um, Australian Floetrol and Boom Gel and Pevio Paints and all kinds of other stuff. I'm not completely ingrained in I don't know everything that's there, but it's definitely worth a look. The Color Art coupon code will get you Prism, prism Pores and Primary Elements. Yep, once it starts it's really hard to stop spiraling, but that's okay because I like my paintings with their spirals. I found a bubble too. I don't mind having schmutz on my skewer that enables me to make a spiral with a different color that creates the spiral. This is a lot like a painting I did the other day that a lot of people seem to like and I did definitely liked. That one looked more like people. I don't know what this one looks like. Yeah, I got it. I felt it. Sorry. Head was in the way. I do like the dark from that um, indigo violet. I also really love taking the Chantilly lace and making spirals out of it. They just make everything pop.
I tend to think it'll ruin it until I do it and then I, then I fall in love every time. So I do love you guys. I hope you come again. I post at 10.15 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Pretty sure I may not be posting on weekends starting soon. But you can always look at my playlists. There are playlists of... There's 30 lists of 100. And they're all separated by topic and genre. So if you ever want something, you can certainly just ask me, because they're all organized and I've got them handy for you. I want to steal some paint. Just imply a line over there. Same thing over here. Why not? That's looking pretty slick. I'm liking it a lot. So I think I'm going to throw my swipe card in the bucket and just figure that that's pretty cool my way and hope that it's as cool your way. Yeah, I like it both ways. Put that in the bucket too. Let's see if I have enough time to shimmer that at you. I always think I could put dots. Gold would be nice in there. You really don't see a lot of gold right now. does remind me of some other things that I've done, but I like those things that I've done that are other things. Let's see if I can get us. That's as close. Let's zoom in. Fun, fun dancing shapes. There's some energy in there. Oh, and my camera battery says it's about to die. So, thank you for the kind words in the comments that keep my morale boosted. I really appreciate the thumbs up and sharing my videos works well for me too. I give lessons at the house in Springville, Florida. I do sell my artwork. My link tree has my Pinterest, Instagram, Twitter links, Facebook group, Expressionist Fluid Art Studio Appreciation Group. My email address is EASPB and the word gallery spelled out at gmail.com. I'd love to sell you a painting. So um, also you feel free to ask questions. I'm happy to answer questions. My community board will show you tomorrow's video. Um, what did I miss? My Amazon link, it's on the on the link tree. I have two books there because I can and unlimited possibilities. Oh wow. Up close and personal, this is tremendously beautiful and there is some gold and I see a bubble up I've got a pop. Well, a couple of them actually. But um I'm sorry I wasn't shimmering at you. This might wind up getting a little more color in it. I'm thinking. I'm not exactly sure how I would do that. There we go. So now I've got a little more color in there. And hopefully you're st I'm still in the, in the picture. I love you guys. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. I'll see you in on whatever I forgot. You'll see in another video. I hope you come again soon. And I um, know you inspire the heck out of me. Take care of each other. Take care of yourselves. Bye for now. Priscilla out.